Being a victim of child abuse is often a long road to recovery. Steve Davis is familiar with this process and is the founder of Rivertime, a charity that lets the role of fly fishing help victims of abuse to heal at the lodge at Palisades. After a longtime manager, Stan Klassen, passed away in 2011, Davis decided to help children who have been abused or neglected on their journey through the healing process by enjoying some of Idaho's greatest treasures. Summer Joy has our story. All of us have kind of been survivors of something. And like, you know, like these kids, I'm a survivor of abuse as well. And so what's happened is, is that I wanted to do something that would introduce kids to something uh, about uh, the river, the Snake River particularly, and fly fishing, and uh, maybe teach them patience, persistency, but most of all, show them something about uh, themselves that they learn on the river. This is the second annual On River Time charity event that offers children the chance to fly fish in the Snake River. Two boys and two girls, along with their guardians from Big Oak Ranch in Alabama, have been chosen for this special event. I mean, it's just, it's beyond words. That's what we kept saying. We just can't find the words to say thank you. We can't find the words to just express what this is. It's amazing. They couldn't be more grateful or excited for this once in a lifetime opportunity. I'm just amazed that I even got to come out here. Um, but being out here is miraculous. I love the sightseeing and stuff, especially while fishing. At first, we thought it was allowed until I pulled it and it just popped up. And went back in the water and I started really. In. I had a lot of fun. Um, I had a great guide, so he taught me how to do everything. It was, it was just a blast. It actually means a lot. It, the people who brought us out here were very kind to actually bring us out here, and so I want to give them a big thanks. Davis's goal is to help show off Idaho's beauty while bringing its peace to these kids and to let them know that they're not alone. There's a lot of people out there who have gone through bad things, and I think it's, it's not necessarily what happens to you, but it's what you do afterwards. Child abuse can be heartbreaking and traumatic. And Davis hopes this mentoring and relationship experience through fly fishing will help inspire these kids to not give up and to know that the future is full of amazing possibilities. I hope that they see how big this world is and that they can they can go out and do whatever they set their mind to. When you really think about these kids and you think about the future leaders of our country, who knows? One of those four kids in the room in there might be the next president of the United States. You never know. And it's great to be able to have a, a venue like the Lodge and like the Snake River and fly fishing to maybe uh, allow them a chance to feel the peace and the opportunity to know that they're not alone. Summer Joy, KPVI, New 6. Davis dreams of one day offering this fly fishing all expenses paid opportunity for one summer month where many kids can come and experience something they might not have the opportunity to otherwise. And for more information on how to make that possible, you can visit rivertime.org.